Okay, next up, I'm gonna show you guys uh, three watches that we have that of that really tanked in value compared to their new prices versus the uh, pre-owned prices. Th these are also the kind of watches that I think a lot of guys would like to buy and wear. And then when you walk into a club or a meeting or wherever, someone would know you have a really, really expensive watch on your wrist, but maybe you didn't get it at the retail price, you actually bought it at the discounted price, which is definitely my advice when it comes to buying these kind of watches. So the first one is a Hublot Big Bang. This is a special edition one that we have in rose gold. This watch retails for around about 600,000 Rand. So, I mean, taking the secondary market on this, you're gonna pay around about 240 to 260,000 Rand, all depending on condition, box and paper. So, as I've always told you guys, really be careful of some of the watches that you go buy brand new in the store. They, um, you can lose a lot of money on them and these are just three examples of them where probably the biggest loss out of all of them is definitely the Hublot Big Bang. The next one is a Cartier Santos. This is probably the best looking Cartier I've seen. It's got a skeleton movement in. Look at that. I think this watch, this watch retailed or store retails for around about 500,000 Rand, which is crazy if you think it's a stainless steel watch. But then again, compare this movement, this is into the Hublot, it's day and night difference. The Cartier is definitely on top of that. So, but this watch on the secondary market, it's selling for 300 to 350,000 Rand. If you bought it currently, you are losing 150,000 plus on a watch like this if you go sell it to a dealer. The last one is a brand you don't often see in South Africa, is the Ulysses Nardine Maximarine Chrono. This was when I was probably around about 25 year, years old. This was one of my favorite watches. I always loved it. And so, so when it came in, I had to buy it. But again, a watch that's got really, this no resale value. I think the retail on this is probably 160, 180, and the secondary market is 50 to 70,000 rands.